Look at this guy on the sidewalk here. It's my old chief right there. I think he knew who you were. I don't know, he just knew. That was weird. Hello? Mark Hatfield is going to be the number one first person ever to attempt our first pancake challenge. Pancake challenge. I don't even know what the pancake challenge is. 12 pancakes, 30 minutes. 12 pancakes, 30 minutes. Is that a lot? Do you think that's a lot? It's way too many <laughs> for one person. So you're gonna make it through four, and then we're gonna put you to bed. <laughs> we'll wake you up in like five hours. Last week I attempted the Wellington Diner Food Challenge and I was unsuccessful. I think I've made a very bad mistake. <laughs> this is my redemption. My second chance. We all make mistakes and fail in life. I am the phoenix rising from the ashes. <laughs> to attempt and to conquer the Pancake Challenge. I brought my kids here for moral support to cheer me on. This stack of pancakes is really a metaphor for life. You take them one at a time. It's like a life experience and when you're done, you die. They're very thick and dense. Delicious pancakes. One pancake done. So easy. These are gluten-free pancakes, right? How you doing with the butter, Mark? I think I pulled a muscle in my neck. A little dippy dippy. Mmm. Oh, not the way to do it. You know we have those moments in life where you just uh, you feel like you just became diabetic? It just happened. Possibly a mistake I'm making here. Uh, you shouldn't even be watching this. Why are you watching this? Go back to work. I don't think the, the pile goes down. I think it's like those napkins. When you take a napkin and a spring pushes up more napkins, I think the spring's pushing up more pancakes. I don't think it's moved. I can feel my bowels moving. People love me. I'm a great pancake eater. <laughs> I do do a good impression. Kramer. <coughs> if they come back up, do I have to eat them again? <coughs> Thank you. My dad's gonna die. I got you a present. It's her birthday, I got her a present. Well on our way. Almost done. Wrapping things up. Oh. I just won a gold medal, apparently. Uh, head spins, uh, way too much sugar. Uh, Officially, uh, I've eaten eight pancakes. Eight pancakes in. Ah. 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 This picture just fell off the wall into my pancakes. Now I have to lick the picture. 
sugar challenge. It's really just a sugar challenge. Now I'm diabetic. I feel like I just went blind. I think I just lost my eyesight. We are the world. We are the children. Thanks, guys. I appreciate all the support. Would you like a pancake? You know, the brown side's brown. The not brown side's not brown. Actually, in football, a pancake block is a very successful block. The pancake block is, uh, is uh, what, what I have in my, uh, my uh, small intestine right now is a pancake block. I've lost my mind. This is just tearing things apart. I don't know what I'm doing anymore. You can do anything you set your mind to in life, boys and girls. Except for eat 12 pancakes. Dream big dreams. Just don't eat too much wheat. A lot of people judging me here today. I seriously can't see it in my eyes. What's happened? Did you see this? This is ridiculous. I don't know. I can't figure it out. They need someone who can do this, who can eat too much food and keep going. This is what the city is craving right now. This is what the world needs. What the world needs now. I'm not a monster. One, ladies and gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, one piece left in the pancake challenge. We're about to do this. Yes, finally I've accomplished something in my life. No! Sometimes in life we bite off more than we can chew. We take on too much and it wins. We all have days like this. Days where we make terrible, horrible decisions, bad life choices. We learn from them and we move on. Looks like I gotta finish what my dad couldn't. Uh. <laughs> Run! <laughs> I just run, <laughs> literally, <laughs> I crack under pressure and run. <laughs>